Connor here from Train Like a Warrior Workouts and welcome to today's 30 minute total body muscle building session that you can perform absolutely anywhere. This session is really going to be focused on helping you build lean and tone muscle mass throughout your entire body. We're going to work the upper and the lower all within this session to really maximize results. If you can, I want you to try to go with heavier dumbbells or a kettlebell with this session so we can really maximize results. Try to work within that eight to 15 rep range for each set and for each exercise. If you haven't got access to heavier weights, you can focus on a few key principles to help add that overload in. You can slow the movement down, focusing on the squeeze and the contraction, or you can bring the intensity and try to push out as many reps as possible and go to near, near failure within each movement. We are gonna perform three sets for each exercise. So it's literally gonna be like a full gym session, took into your home, your travels, wherever you're working out at, so we can literally maximize results with these real-time sessions. So I really want you to get focused, get motivated, get prepared, bring the intensity with this session, push your body. It's only gonna be 30 minutes and it's gonna be one of the best sessions that you've ever performed. So let's get ready and let's do it. The first exercise is gonna be high squat. So if you're using two dumbbells, hold them up high and perform your squat right down. If you're using one weight, just go with the goblet squat or whatever you want to do, as long as you're pushing your body. We're gonna go 35 seconds of work, 25 seconds of rest, as I really want you to try to lift heavier and push your body. Now, if you're using a lighter weight and the 35 seconds are up, feel free to add in an extra few reps and then rest the remaining and then get into the next set, okay? So 10 second countdown begins now. Let's try to push the body to the limit. I'm going with heavy dumbbells here of a set lighter for if I wanna drop the weight. Right, away we go. Three sets now for each movement. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, 25 rest. Now this is a slower pace session because this is a strength and muscle building workout. Okay, so take the recovery and then get ready to push out the next set. Three, two, one. My goal is about eight to twelve reps. Okay, last set of these high squats, and then we're moving on to chest press. Okay. Get ready to go. And because you're holding the weights up above, you're not only targeting the lower body, Core's engaged, as well as upper body to hold the weight up. <sighs> 10 seconds, let's go. <sighs> okay team. 25 of recovery. Next exercise is chest press. I'm just gonna do it lying on the ground. However, if you have the bench, add in the bench. Three, two, one.
Perfect. Recovery and go again. As I said, if you've reps left in you, push them out. Even if the timer goes by the... Set of these and then we're gonna move on. Now don't be alarmed if you're not feeling that you're getting a sweat on whatever. This is to solely focus on building and shaping off your physique. Because so many people go wrong, you think just jumping about doing endless amounts of cardio is gonna get them the result, and then they're left with no shape within the physique. But this type of heavy strength training will not make you bulky, but it'll actually burn more calories and it'll shape off your physique. So this is why we're adding in the combination of strength workouts alongside higher intensity sessions. Onto the feet, deadlifts. Gonna go straight down and up. Dumbbell deadlift. The next one. You have 10 seconds of recovery. Go for it. And honestly, I'm loving this workout. It's slower paced, but it's allowing you to focus on getting good form, lift a bit heavier weights if you can, and it's a full body muscle building workout. A brilliant way to kick off week three. Last set of deadlifts, then we're moving on to shoulder press. Now remember, it's up to you to push your own body. If you're not feeling that it's working, that your uh, body's not pushing to the limit, you need to bring up the intensity or you need to lift heavier weights because these exercise combinations are absolutely brilliant to push your body to get results. Okay, stand and shoulder press is next.
you have to go into the workouts with the mindset that you're going to push your body because that is how you're going to see results at a quicker time frame. Yeah, it's probably a tough one, especially if you're going heavy. Well, reps for me, keep pushing it if you have it. Wet. It's mad how lifting heavier weights you need to sweat just as much as a non stop cardio condition test. Right, ready to go again, three, two, one. Let's go. Oh God. Okay, I think you're recovering. One more set of these shoulder presses, and we have one more movement to finish off round one before we get a, a quick drink. Right, we ready? One in, three, two, one. Let's go. Work team, let's keep on pushing. Right, the next one is walking lunges or just forward lunges. So if you haven't got much space, go forward and back. Or if you have a bit of room, do a few walks up and down. Okay, it's up to you. Depending on the area that you have access. I'm gonna try to go with these two heavier weights. It's gonna be tough. In the barn. <sighs> Ten seconds. Let's try getting our few reps. Yeah, but... <sighs> the whole body here is burning. Heart race up also, 10 seconds left for recovery. Get ready for your second set of lunges. Come on, three, two, one, let's go. Remember, if you can't get the walk and lunging, just forward and back. That's all you need. That's all I got. Three, two, one. Right team, one more set. One more set of these lunges.
Right, we ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, That's all I got. Okay team, quick drink, what a hell of a round. Get, a, get that drink in there, get pre prepared for round number two. Round one has me busted, but let's keep this momentum, brilliant work. Okay team, let's get into it, round number two. Gonna kick it off, three sets, bent over, dumbbell rows, okay? If you're using one weight, you can even go one arm, okay, then switch the opposite arm. And then the last set, you can double it up with the one weight. But if you're using the two dumbbells, go for it with both arms. If you're using a heavy weight, try to go for that eight to 15 rep range. Okay? Get ready, the countdown is on. We are going five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Keep going if you have it. Good. Brilliant. Take your recovery, relax for a second, and then we're going straight back into it. We're treating this here as if it's just a full gym session. We're going for the reps, then we're resting about 30 seconds, 25 seconds, and going back into it. Okay? Right, we're going in three, two, one. Here we go again. Brilliant. Keep going if you have it. Take your recovery. One more set of rows, and then we're going into one and a half push ups. Okay, three, two, So I got again, that is a tough movement when you're going with heavy weight. Really helps shape off the back, the biceps, as well as the core. Right, this next one is a one and a half push up. We're going down, okay, then you go halfway, back up again. Down fully, down halfway, back up, down, okay? One and a half push up. Again, you can go on your knees if you need to. Three, two, Down fully, halfway, up. Good. 
Quick recovery, 25 seconds. Possibly the toughest workout of the challenge so far. We are going in three, two, one. Like I said, remember team, don't be afraid to drop down onto those knees. Ten seconds of recovery. I saw you ten seconds remaining. Keep going. Okay, last set of these push ups. Now we're going to move on to legs. What a workout so far. Right, get ready. We're going in 10 seconds. I'm sweating. The whole, mu the whole body muscles are feeling pumped as well as the sweat. So this just goes to show you this isn't only a strength session. We're definitely burning a good amount of calories with this one. Right, get these one and a half reps. Ten seconds, let's go. Sumo squats. Wide stance. We all know this one if you've been doing these workouts for any time. Down and up. You can add in a pulse if you want to. Make it more difficult. Legs are shaking. Ten seconds. Go. Good. Have a drink. Seconds from Ten seconds, let's try to get the reps. Come on, eight to twelve, eight to fifteen. Lovely. One more set of these two moves. Ten seconds. Nice 
Si don team. Okay. The next one is a combo. Front raise into side raise. So front, side. Front into side. Okay. Gotta lighten the weights for this one. Lovely work. Right, we have another 10 seconds of recovery and then back into it. This is the second last exercise of our 30 minute muscle building session. Okay, three, two, one. Let's go. Front and the side. set of these raises. Nearly there. Come on. Keep on pushing it out. Right team, let's go. Try to get the reps. Lovely work. Okay team, this is it, finish line. It's gonna be bicep curves, okay? Just curves, you can do any variation you want. You can go hammer curves, alternating curves, double curves, it's up to you. Let's finish strong now. Focus on good form if you're using a lighter weight. Keep the squeeze at the top. Let's go. Target literally every body part there within 30 minutes. Right, five left, recovery. Let's go. Well, 
Going go it. Last set. Take that recovery and let's get ready to push it out. Home run now. Okay team, three, two, one, let's go. seconds. Go on, five, four, three, two, one. Dirty squad, what a hell of a session. Our 30 minute full body muscle builder complete. Just want to say a massive well done. That was definitely one of the most effective sessions that we have done yet within our Spartan Shred Challenge. What an incredible work out some incredible compound movements in there to really maximize results. Literally taking the gym into your own home or your travels or even if you're in the gym, literally like have a major personal trainer right there beside you. Team, if you enjoyed this session, please be sure to leave this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment below, hold yourself accountable. Let me know you completed the workout and let me know how you got on with the session. Tag me in your stories, share this challenge with your mates, get them in on it. And if you want to work more personally alongside with me, join Warrior Squad, training like at warrior.co.uk and let's take your results to the next level. Keep up the momentum and I'll see you in the next one.